Our product is sort of medium, me, medium to slightly high end. It's a niche gourmet product. It's all handmade. The packaging is very distinct, very different to what's out there in the market. So that level was set. Um, the, we use premium chocolate as well, Belgian Calibo. So if if someone loves Cadbury chocolate bars by the truckload, they're not our customer. It's more for someone who knows the finer things in life and appreciates a handmade product with uh, premium quality ingredients. Um, we were working together with another party who was already exporting and they brought us along and that's how we kind of got into the international exhibitions and that's how there was interest in our products and we were able to then develop it from there. I guess in business it has been finding distributors who can work the market with a particular type of product. Uh, we know the product that's available in Coles or Safeway um, and we, we don't want to be but at the same time we are quite niche in that sense so finding people that are servicing those sorts of markets has been a bit hard. Uh, with the overseas market um, with the food shows and the help with Australia it has not been difficult as such. Um, We've overcome every barrier as we as we get along and progress into orders. Uh, people can work with uh, our timelines. Everything is discussed prior. The expectations are all there. We just deliver and it's worked well. I think it's really wonderful when you think of there is a person out there in Dubai that's eating our chocolates uh, or in Hong Kong and it just gives you a really good feel because we small, we come from a small city in Melbourne, we hand make everything and to actually have that reach, is, it's, it's a great feeling. Believe in yourself because people, everyone, you just question yourself, you don't have that that faith that you can do something and that only comes with experience and you realize that you're over worried about things and overthink things and then when you look back is should have believed in yourself a bit more <laughs> the advice I would give myself would be to believe in myself uh, and be a bit more assertive I guess but at the same time when you're new in a business it's a bit hard to do that so you are learning as you go along but um, it's not a hugely difficult thing to do. But um, yeah, looking back, a bit more self-belief. Yeah.